Welcome to another CTV Sports presentation. CTV Sports is brought to you by St. Clair Chevy Buick GMC. We care. By Murphy Inn Restaurant and Hotel in St. Clair. By North Star Bank, North Star Guiding the Way. By Neiman's Family Market. By St. Clair Home Goods and Ace Hardware. And by CTV, Community TV for Marine City and St. Clair. Good afternoon, everyone, and or good afternoon. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to St. Clair Saints basketball. John Carter, long time Brenner, and we're very pleased to bring you tonight's game as the Saints have a gold contest against Warrenwood Tower. Saints top of the league, two and one record. Tower is one of those teams also at the top of the gold with two and one. Be a tough battle, I think, tonight. Towers already played a couple of uh, good games against teams in the gold, and the Saints now look to defend their home court and stay on top of the league. Teams have left the court, lining up at midcourt. Let's turn it over to Coach Denny White for the introduction of the players and the playing of the national anthem. Ladies and gentlemen, would you please rise and face the flag? Gentlemen, please remove your caps as we honor America this evening with our national anthem sung by St. Clair High School's own Victoria Bovey. Tonight's starting lineup in the spirit of sportsmanship made in alternating fashion, beginning with the Titans. Seniors, number one, Matt Kills. For the Saints, junior, number one, Austin Schweiger. For Tower, junior, number two, Bryce Sanders. For St. Clair, junior, number 13, Ryan Zimmer. For the Titans, senior, number three, Lee Beasley. For the Saints, senior number 14, Scott Selleck. For the Titans, senior number 11, Charles Anderson. For St. Clair, senior number 21, Matt Eisenhart. For the Titans, junior number 12, Hassan Posey. For 
for the Saints, junior number 31, Sean Donaldson. The Titans are coached by Nick Abula, assisted by Ron Kokan. The Saints are coached by Corey Canton, assisted by Matt Pistolet and Todd Cullen. Well, welcome back, everyone. And Tom mentioned before, kind of a tough matchup. Saints got to defend their home court against a tough tower team. Yeah, last year these two teams battled uh, battled quite a bit, came down to the their last matchup in order to clinch a championship, if I remember correctly. And uh, both teams underwent some, some changes, some of them significant, some of them maybe not so significant, but uh, this should be a good matchup. On paper, at least, they match up pretty well. We'll see how this one goes here at St. Clair High School. Both teams at 2-1 and one in the gold. Zimmer, Ryan Zimmer, number 13 for the Saints, to be jumping against number three, that's Lee Beasley for the Titans. Saints also have Donaldson, Eisenhart, Selleck, and Schweiger. Tipped away and nicely, quickly to number one, that's Matthew Bills, and Titans score off a set play. Eisenhart into Selleck. Schweiger brings it up. Picked off by Titans. All the win, can't get it. Rebounded by Number two, that's Rice Sanders, a quick 4 nothing lead for Warren Woods Tower. No physical press, Tom, and uh, got to imagine this is kind of the way Tower wants to play this one. Speed it up a little bit, get him moving the ball, get him in a rush. There's Selleck, Donaldson. John Donaldson out front, Got by Bryce Sanders, popped out. Tipped away again by Tower. Tried to go behind the back, but picked off by St. Clair, but stolen back by Tower. Good effort. Tough place to save a basketball, but it'll work out. That's Beasley in the corner. Tries to go by Eisenhart. And you can tell right now, this is going to be a, a physical game. Yes. Refs going to let them go a little bit, and both teams going to have to adjust to that. Schweiger pulls it up at half court. And the Saints trailing 4 0. We'll try to get a shot. <laughs> Eisenhart tipped away again. And this one's going to be physical. Yes, yeah, so you can tell the you can tell that they are uh, exactly what you just mentioned. They're trying to get used to the they're letting them reach a little bit, get their hands on the basketball. Sean Donaldson out front. Sanders on him. Sanders is, is working extremely hard on defense. Got to give him a lot of credit. Schweiger deep in the corner. John Deep Eisenhart turns in, and he's fouled. The hard part for the Saints is with, with Sanders and, and these guys playing such tough in-your-face defense is they're having trouble getting the basketball to move. Basketball is sticking a little bit, and that's kind of allowing them to sit back and almost play like a safety in football. They've waited for those couple steals. Uh, but, but good job to get it into Eisenhardt. If he goes up quick like that, he'll go to the line or either get a bucket, get, yeah. look, get a good look at it at least. Eisenhardt on the line, shooting two. 6'3 senior, first shot just back rim, no good. Saints looking for their first point. Eisenhardt bounces a couple times, sets and shoots. That one's good. 4-1, Tower, and the Saints put on pressure of their own. Not a bad idea early on. We saw in the junior varsity game before this, St. Clair went to a pressure defense in the second half, and it paid off for him. Beasley quickly. Shots off by Sanders, and Zimmer with a rebound. Here comes Schweiger. Austin Schweiger goes deep. Gets it up, can't score, rebounded by Anderson. Anderson quickly up court. Good pass, Beasley scores. I like the idea by Schwager to, to push that on the offensive side, but Tower is off and running here early on. Saints going to have to balance the floor. What that means is making sure someone's back and everybody's not going to be able to crash the boards on, on this team because they like to get out and they, run, they want to run it fast. 6-1 for Tower, and I think the other thing Coach doing is get the team settled down a little bit and get used to the, the, the physical nature of the game already. Yeah, and, and honestly, just to get them to settle in a little bit. You know, sometimes 
sometimes it feels like it's 10 or 12 or 14 to 1 when it's really 6 to 1. You're only down by 5. Uh, get something going uh, on offense. They're not scoring on easy sets offensively when it comes to tower. You don't have it all going bad. Sometimes you just need to look them in the eye and let them know that right. so, so that they can uh, they slow it down in their brain a little bit. Excellent. A good point. And Saints trail 6-1. First game back with the students back from winter True. break. Saints had a game last week against Rose Point North, which is a pretty good team, I think, this year. Saints had trouble with them. But there's been kind of an interesting, both both these teams have played Frazier. Saints beats Frazier. Titans lost. Here's Zimmer in the middle. Turns. Can't get it. Rebounded by Donaldson with good hustle. Drives in and scores. And John Donaldson does not mind a little physical play. He's going to be just fine with that. He doesn't mind it, and a good good uh, response by the Saints out of that timeout. This is Anderson out front, guarded by Eisenhart. All the way in, blocked, but picked up the foul. I think that's going to be, I think Eisenhart had all ball. I think that might be on number 14. Yeah, that was on Selleck with the help. Two fair foul, number 13, Ryan Zimmer. His first, team's first. I don't think it was Zimmer, but maybe they'll correct that. I look like a 1-4 went up on, yeah. from the referee if I saw that from way back here. First shot up by Anderson. Charles Anderson is a senior guard. We'll have to get our uh, sideline reporter on that because <laughs> that's, that's, right. that's going to be an important one. <laughs> Figure Leslie, out who that Leslie ball Leslie Visser is when we need her, right? <laughs> Second shot for Anderson short that time and rebounded by Zimmer. Up quickly, Schweiger. I like this. Way. I like them pushing it a little bit. Don't let them settle in on defense. Uh, Schweiger got that back quickly. Schweiger and Hassan. Good pass. Beasley can't. gets the rim and second basket for Lee Beasley. Yep, he's up to four points. 9 5. Saints trail. Eisenhower quickly to Donaldson in the corner. Schweiger, three-pointer, a little short, rebounded by Sanders. He gets it up to Bills. Good pick up by Zimmer that time. Anderson, open three. Can't get it, rebounded by Zimmer. Gotta like the way Zimmer goes after the basketball. Nathan Schweiger. Selleck, three-pointer, partially blocked. And here comes Anderson. Up ahead, Bills. And you can see the way Tower's set up. They're almost playing without a center. It's all right. guards and forwards easily with a tough run. And <laughs> wondering Man where foul was at that time taken away by Hassan Beasley. Takes it to the basket and scores. And that's going to be a foul on Zimmer. Not to go back to our sideline reporter joke, but I think we'll probably find out who the first foul was on based off of what, uh, what coach decides to do here. Must have been. Brady Gleason will come in replacing Zimmer, and that's the second foul for Ryan Zimmer. Brady Gleason has played quite a bit so far this year. Not as tall as Zimmer, but good physical hard player. Beasley would again with a basket. Donaldson brings up court, guarded by Beasley. Eisenhart rotates it to Gleason. Selleck. Eisenhart. Donaldson pull up three. Tough shot. Tipped away and controlled by Tower. Beasley spins and scores. He's quick with him with the basketball. He's making him pay. And he's left handed and he's helped a couple of those already. Tipped got, away by I've Tower. I've got him up to 10 points. A frenetic pace so far, and Saints might be do well to just calmly approach this one. 14-5. Mm -hmm. Eisenhardt out front. Gleason down deep to Selleck. Gleason again, Eisenhardt. Good job to work the basketball around. I gotta keep it moving. 
Got Selleck to Schweiger. Now deep, Donaldson, Eisenhardt open. Jumper snow good, rebounded by Beasley from Tower. And he's gonna be fouled from behind by Selleck. It's pretty good patient offense by the Saints. They got a good look off of it. That's gonna be the biggest thing I think going forward here is don't let Tower force you into something you don't really want to do, especially offensively. Um, that, that's a shot you can live with. It was a, a pretty open three. So it'll start going down and that'll change things up a little bit. Garrison Zembrowski comes in. BC guarded by Schweiger. Hassan, long three, can't get it. Rebounded nicely by Lee with a good box out. Yep. Schweiger. Browski. All the way in, and it's going to be called jump ball, probably. Good block by Woods Tower. And it'll say Saints basketball. 14 5. Tower with a quick lead here. Saints ball underneath their own basket. Gleason can't control. Picked up by Dabrowski. Pull up. Can't get it. Rebound is again picked up and scored by Dombrowski. Harrison with a good job using his body. Kept the taller Tower player away from him. Well, it's kind of important as you mentioned. Uh, it looks like Tower has one, one player on the floor that stands out to me as a, as a somewhat tall guy, and that's for Sean Merriweather, number 10. But besides that, they don't have anybody who, like you said, is a center or a, or a true power forward. Um, so he took advantage down there being able to, uh, to rebound and be physical as a guard. And can't make the free throw, but that's still a big uh, possession for the Saints. Lee Beasley coming up court. Knocked away and lost by Tower. Maybe tried to do too much. That's the first time that uh, he probably took on three players that time and just not a, um, not a lane. Yeah, not as much of a, as a part of the flow of the offense or part of a more of a fast break style as, as he's gotten most of his points. But that's something to maybe keep an eye on if yeah. you're the Saints. It's forced him to try to get his points in the half court. All right, Dombrowski comes up. Down deep. Gleason can't, can't control it. Saints again put some pressure on. Anderson. Hassan Posey. Number five's in, Christopher Kyles for the first time. Down deep, Anderson in and out. Good rebound that time by Selleck. Schweiger. Selleck, lefty, gets his own rebound. Nice pass, Good Eisenhardt. Fine. Thought about it. Schweiger, all the way in and scores. That makes it 14-9. It's no coincidence that when the Saints move the ball and it doesn't stick, they're getting, they're getting buckets. Posey to Anderson, back to Posey. I think it makes a difference that Beasley's not there as well. That's uh, the guy that finishes for yep. Power, although that was a nice play that time, give and go between Anderson and number 15, that's Dwayne Ware. Good finish by Ware, 16-9. 35 seconds now, first quarter. Gleason, nice pass. Dombrowski open, three-pointer, yes! And Garrison Dombrowski, Garrison Dombrowski, as he also has, comes in, gives a quick lift for the Saints. Five points for him, 16-12. Tipped away, Schweiger. Couldn't quite control, but all-out hustle that time by the Saints, and uh, <coughs> nothing wrong with that effort. Not at all, especially when you had something going. Lay it out there with just 12 seconds left in the first quarter. Now bring the same energy to the defensive side, continue that. Gerald Linovsky, Griffith Delore comes in. Under 10. Bills long three-pointer, gets nothing. Stops with the rebound. And that'll be it for the first quarter in a fast pace, tough first quarter. Saints lead 16-12. We'll be right back after a word from our sponsors. St. Clair Home Goods and Ace Hardware is open seven days a week in the Riverview Plaza. 
Everything you need in hardware, from wiring, paint, tools, outdoor equipment, and even picnic and camping items. Check the specials on Valspar Paint and the Ace Hardware Specials. St. Clair Home Goods and Ace Hardware also has a complete gift department with candles, outdoor furniture, grills, and much, much more. St. Clair Home Goods and Ace Hardware. Well, welcome back, everyone. John Carter, Tom Brenner, cameraman JP. And very happy to bring you tonight's game. Warren was tower lead, 16-12 over the Saints, but uh, good comeback by the Saints, Tom, and I think they weathered that initial rush. Definitely. And I think it, it's even more. I mean, in sports, we like hindsight, right? So I think we can go back and say that that timeout did pay off. They did, Tower did respond a little bit after that, but I think that the general premise of that timeout paid off for the Saints. All right, Jared Lenarski, Son Bills, Donaldson, Dombrowski, Anderson, three. Couldn't get it. Rebound by Tower. Long three, that one's good. That was number 15, Dwayne Ware, with his second basket. And that was good movement by Tower. I found the open shooter. Yeah, Nebraska. it's interesting. We mentioned Veasley, and I was just getting ready to say that they're starting the second quarter without him, but I think Ware came in for him, and he's got himself up to five points. Good for him. Lombrowski, guarded by Anderson. Lenarski, Delore, three. No good, rebounded by Donaldson, and he's fouled. <laughs> I think Griffin Delore will say that was just a pass. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But Donaldson in good position, and we've said a couple times, three-pointers that either graze the rim or don't hit the rim are very difficult, and that time, Sean Donaldson in the right spot, and good rebounding position, he's on the line for two. First shot's up, back rim no good. Second shot for Sean Donaldson. Shots up, back rim no good, rebounded by Anderson. Up ahead to Sanders, and back to Anderson. Where, again, open, he's oh. got. I don't know if he's normally a starter for them or not, but he came off the bench for this one. And he's got himself up to eight. Good looking strokes there, so Dombrowski working hard. It's gonna be a foul on Anderson, I think. It's our uh, crowd and bench. I think we're looking for an offensive foul there. He got him with a little bit of an arm hook, but as you mentioned, a little contact going in this one. Letting it go for the most part. Ryan Zimmer back in. He's got two personal fouls. Saints gonna be careful. Dombrowski, Donaldson, diagonal cut. Good pass, Zimmer takes it to the basket, gets the bump and scores. Nice pass that time by Dombrowski. And Ryan Zimmer with his first basket, has a chance for a three-point play. First foul on Ware. Shots up, and it's good. I think it'd be nice to see him get going because of that size advantage that he has for the most part. Where? Goes to right, Anderson. Nice pass down deep, and gonna call travel. Jump on his feet just as he was catching that ball. And Beasley comes back in, replaces Brownsley, Brownlee. I was going to say before they didn't call the travel, it's, it's a little borderline three seconds for a few of these possessions uh, for Tower. Selleck comes back in, replaces Jared Lenarski. More pressure here. Dabrowski to Donaldson. 22-15. Just over six minutes here watching St. Clair Saints basketball on... CTV, community television. Zimmer looks deep. Leeson, nice pass. Great pass. And Selleck with a conversion off the beautiful pass by Brady Gleason. 
And they did that a couple times in football as well. So yeah, there you go. That worked out very nicely. You, of course, could see that on CTV, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Beasley. Where has be careful it? not to lose track of Beasley after he entered the game again. Picked off by Zimmer. Up ahead, Gleason. Good fake and got Beasley in the air and converted the layup after the, the tower player left his feet. That was smart right there by Brady Gleason. I'm pretty sure Beasley had him lined up for a, a block off, a, off the layup, but he jump stopped and made the good fake. Sanders can't get it. Rebound by Selleck. A lot of one and done sparking this run. Dombrowski. <laughs> Fights through it, but Garrison with a good play. Gleason thought about it. Gets back out of the lane. Sean Donaldson. Gleason. Tipped off the hands of St. Clair. And nice conversion by Matthew Bills. Smart not to foul. Sometimes you just got to concede a bucket. 24-19. One and a half minutes left. First, four, first half. Salik. Again, can't make those kind of slow passes. Oh, and a little bit too much. Mustard on that hot dog. <laughs> Zimmer, three-pointer. Can't get it. Oh, boy, that would have been a big, big hoop. <clears throat> That would have blown the roof off the gym if he knocked down that three. Anderson out front. Donaldson can't hold it. And Anderson, Anderson all the way to the hoop. And it makes it 26-19. Donaldson, or I'm sorry, Dabrowski brings it up. Now Donaldson. Needs a little help. Wow, quick travel call. And maybe just a little bit too much dribbling out front. Yeah. I know they're on top of you, but you got to get rid of the basketball and cut and make them pay for those reaches. Part of Nebrowski, Austin Schweiger come in. Intensity picking up a little bit here in the gym for sure. Where? Anderson. That's going to be foul. Good effort, though, by Gleason. Neither team really in foul trouble yet. That's uh, the Saints' fourth team foul. First foul on Brady Gleason. Tower with a 26 19 lead. Where to Anderson. Long three pointer. No good. Rebounded by Zimmer. Here comes Schweiger, up ahead. Gleason tipped away by Tower. Get back. Gleason with the dunk. Here comes Donaldson. And the Saints a timeout. That's, you can't pick the ball up there at that, where the half court and the sideline come together. You have extra two defenders there, and uh, any kind of double team there is doubly effective, as they say. Yeah, and honestly, not the worst timing <laughs> for him to get trapped there. You know, the same thing as earlier. Sometimes you want to call a timeout. Don't get me wrong. Everybody likes seeing dunks, especially when it's on your team. What do we always say? Tony Monio has been saying it forever. It still counts for two Just points. Just two points. The more important thing is not that he tried to dunk it once and then dunked it another time. It's that the Saints are turning the basketball over. That's what's leading to a dunk. He doesn't get a chance to do whatever he was trying to do the first time if the Saints don't turn the ball over. And I think what you're saying is true. Tower's gotten most of their points on fast break. I haven't seen a lot of baskets or really even good attempts off their, their set of offense. Correct. If, it, if it's happening in the half court, then you got a defensive problem. Your offense is what's creating the easy chances. That's something you can control. That's something that I'm sure Coach uh, hit on there. But I don't mind on that last time the Saints brought the ball back down, they got the ball deep. That didn't allow them to get that, uh, that easy pressure up there. See if the Saints can break this. Schweiger. Gets it to Carter Nabrowski. Nice catch by Eisenhart. And tipped away again by Tower. Here comes Beasley. Good pass ahead. 
and scored by Bills. That makes it 30-19, and for the first time, Saints are getting a little bit out of control here. Yep. Need a, bus need a bucket here. Donaldson. And you gotta give Towers some credit. They're bringing some serious intensity to the defensive side. Yeah, if you try to do a, a kind of a hesitation or just a kind of a casual back away dribble, it's, it's uh, <laughs> that's not working right now. Nope. Eisenhart knocked away. Anderson, and he scores. And it's so tough, you're trying to calm your, your team down offensively. They're in your face. Right. Well, what, one of the things that happened is, is and you, you've got to meet passes. And that, what that means is you've got to go to where the, the big guy has to come towards the ball. If you wait for the ball to get to you, these quick hands with the guards are going to be all over it. That was Carter Dombrowski going hard in the basket. I'm not sure if it's a shooting foul or not. Nicky Vola, the head coach of Tower, not exactly pumped about that call. Thought his team drew a charge, but you know, that's one thing we saw the Saints doing was they were able to get the basketball kind of in the paint area. It led to an open three. They didn't get the bucket, but there you go. Off the inbound yep. pass, easy buckets. Zimmer with a quick try to shrink the court a little bit. But you got to be able to get it up over half court and into right. your offense to be able to True. get those shots. Posey up front where. That's Bills, Anderson, open three. No good, rebounded by Schweiger. So you can see him meet him at half court. That's tough to overcome, but if the Saints move the ball, they can beat it. Yeah, difficult pass that time, yeah. not really the right angle. Right. And it remained 11 point. Tower lead, minute 19 seconds left, first half. It's only 11. Get a stop here, get a bucket, get it single Try digits. To get get under, under, under single digits, exactly. Sanders. Beasley. Way out front. Nice catch by Bills. Takes a hoop and scores. Donaldson to Carter Dombrowski. And 13 point lead for Tower. Under a minute. So much dribbling. There's whistle there. That's a foul on Bryce Sanders. I think he was grabbing his arm, <laughs> and that was the call from the off referee. And this is where, this Donaldson. is where, like how you were saying earlier, they're letting them play a little bit. I think the tower coaches, their beef is probably, this has been going on for almost two quarters. Why now? That's probably their, not that they're right or wrong, but that's probably what their beef is. Donaldson. Who shots up and it's good. Call me crazy. I think this free throw right here is actually kind of important. Make them in behind the basketball. Yes. Don't let them get the ball and run down the court again. Good it's substitution by stoppage. Yeah. Good substitution that time by Corey Tanton. He's gotten Zimmer out. He'll stay with two fouls. And Ryan did a nice job <laughs> staying with the two fouls the last three or four minutes here in the second quarter. See the make also allowed on the sub again, and now they can set up a little bit. Yep. Sanders to Anderson. In the middle, Bills. See what Tower does, will he hold for the last yeah. shot of the <laughs> first sure half like or it. will they attack again? This is Sanders and Beasley. Fully spread out here and again, just what we talked about. Tower does not play with a center really it looks like. Down to 14 seconds and too much dribbling. And good play by Schweiger. That's the, the old big boy special, two for one. Turnover and the foul. Yep. Third foul on Sanders. And then they're shooting free throws, and guess what? Nobody's running around like crazy people. The clock is stopped. You got a chance to score 
two points if you make the first one. Get it down to single digits. Good shot to Tiger. Nope. Back rim, no good. Rebounded by Bills. Under 10. Here comes Posey. Anderson. Three seconds. Long three is no good. Just off the rim. And I don't know, Tom, it, it looked like it could almost get away from the Saints, but they kind of come back. 11-point deficit, but last couple of minutes they seemed more calm. Yeah. I mean, it's what we were talking about very early in the game. It's not nearly as bad as it may seem. They're only down 11 points. They got a couple of dunk attempts. They, I don't have a tally of how many turnovers St. Clair had, but quite frankly, it could be a lot worse. <laughs> I mean, they, they could have had a, they had some easy chances they didn't convert on after turning the ball over. I don't know. You can't be super pumped you're down 11 points to a team you're turning the ball over, but you're fine. 11 Six. points is not a big deal. Exactly right. Well, 34-23 after the first half. This is John Carter with Tom Brenner. We'll be back in just a moment to bring you the second half. Come to the Murphy Inn and enjoy the pub atmosphere or the dining room, which both offer a diner's menu. Murphy Inn offerings include the best pizza, burgers, ribs, steak, and fish around. Plus, there are great daily specials, such as endless pasta, chicken, or fish and chips. Karaoke is every Wednesday and Saturday from 8 p.m. until midnight. Murphy Inn hosts live entertainment each Thursday and Friday from 8 until midnight. The Byrne Huber family appreciates the opportunity to serve you at the Murphy Inn. North Star Bank is a true community bank whose loan approvals are made locally by bankers who live in our community, understanding your needs and will meet face to face to discuss what's important to you. From opening accounts to recommending products and services, North Star Bank looks forward to sitting down with you and building a strong relationship to reach your financial goals. North Star Bank, guiding the way. Loans are subject to credit approval, equal housing lender, and member of FDIC. All right, welcome back, everyone. John Carter along with Tom Brenner, JP on camera. And after that first half, Saints trail. 34-23, and as we said before, two teams that share the lead in the goal division of the MAC, and uh, really this is going to be one of those times I think there's a lot of pretty evil, equal teams in the goal division, and, and Tom, I think it's going to be a big thing about kind of defending your home court, and uh, Saints have an 11-point deficit to make up and uh, two quarters to do so. Yeah, and, and coming into this game, Tower... They, they weren't exactly a defensive juggernaut. They are not giving up uh, what they're on pace for, which would be 46 points a game. Um, they're giving up 57 points, almost 58 points a game. Uh, so if the Saints can settle in a little bit offensively, not turn the basketball over and get some easy buckets, they'll be right back in this basketball game. All right, Eisenhardt, Donaldson, Schweiger, Zimmer, and Selleck. Selleck open, Eisenhardt, three-pointer. Back rim can't get it. And... Strong rebound from number 15, Dwayne Ware, who's got to start here in the second half. He played very well off the bench for Tower in the first half. I feel like he starts normally. It might might be. <laughs> yeah. uh, um, there may have been something going on there, but I, I think he normally, he plays heavy minutes. He's got it. Sasan Posey out front. Ware on the weave to Beasley, and he picks up the foul. Scott Selleck. And Beasley, Beasley explodes to the yes. basket, Tom. He's, he's quick once he gets that, that vision in his head. He does, and then the Saints started that possession to be doing a better job of kind of clogging that lane up. But then when Beasley got the basketball, it opened up a little bit, and he doesn't need a whole lot of space to get to the rim. But you'll take, I think at this point, you'll take uh, making him earn it at the free throw line. He's probably a good free throw shooter, shooter but it's still not an easy basket. First one's down. Beasley. Six, two and a half, six, three, senior. First, second shot's not as good. There you go. By Zimmer. That was the third foul on Selleck. He's got a lane. Tries to go down to Zimmer. And tipped away. And I don't even want to think about who tried to make that call. <laughs> I guess it was off. Tower. Posey, number 12, was the last person to touch it. Looks like it was off the Saints to, to me from this angle, but you know what? That sometimes the hustle pays off. Schweiger. And 
turned over again. Saints just, again, here's almost a minute gone third quarter, have yet to be able to get a shot off, and that's, that's the tough part here. Tower's just creating a lot more possessions. Beasley, tough. And that was, a, that was a set play. Fake him in and then let him go deep, and he caught it in stride and made no mistake. And when he doesn't get too fancy, he can definitely dunk that basketball. Exactly. Tower did, Tower did bring a decent crowd. Yep. But you know what? He's on the road. It's not the same as if he was dunking it a few times at Tower. Anderson gets his second personal. Schweiger, double team here. Got, him, got to help him here. Schweiger, double teamed. And see what's happening here, as you can see it, when the Saints do that backcourt job and send it pass it back, Tower automatically double teams that. So you've got to very quickly catch that ball and don't dribble right away, but look who's open because there's going to be somebody open. Exactly. And, and it's tough for the Saints. They're almost trying to get into their offense before they get the basketball inbounded. And then, the, then that pressure really throws them off. Posey to Bills. Hassan Posey. Anderson, try to go back door to BC. All the way in was, was Bill. Team defense here. Zimmer, Schweiger, someone should be open. Down deep, good pass to Selleck, but couldn't connect. The second pass to Zimmer. Foul on Schweiger. Garrison Dabrowski comes in, replaces Selleck. I'd like to see the Saints defense start sparking them. Same thing that's working for Tower. Three pointer, no good. Rebounded by Dabrowski. Up ahead. And that just plays into Tower's hands. Nice follow by 15, that's Ware again. And he's in double figures, I think, and he's just not, played a good game. Not all the Saints got back there either. Kind of got a, got a couple misses. But they were outnumbered. 39-23, down to five and a half minutes. Eisenhart, Schweiger, Zimmer, and he scores. Good look. There's, if they could just get the ball to Ryan, yeah. he has an advantage, but it's just been so difficult getting into their offense. Anderson looks for Feasley again to cut Posey. Where? Went back to Feasley. Good pass. Where gets it? That's good slip That's screen. Great offense. Nice pass by Anderson. And Beasley draws a crowd, which he yep. should, but Ware knew what to do, go to the basket. That's a tough pass. I've said before, trying to pass the post from out front there, there's no angle, and it's just really difficult to do. And it's and the other hard part is, is that the, the better angle is a little bit lower, but every time they go there, they're swarmed. Yep. Brady Gleason in. Garrison Dombrowski, Carter Dombrowski, Donaldson, Dombrowski. Zimmer, Donaldson. Saints just look out of sorts today. They do, and not a lot of movement. Zimmer, nice pass. Gleason. Up oh, quickly, Beasley. Posey. BC again with the angle. Tipped away, controlled by Sanders out front. Where? Three pointer. No, oh, not that time. That's going to be a rebounding foul against Tower on Beasley. The yeah, Tower coach, Nick Evola, he, he's not pumped about something. Initially, he wasn't that pumped about the way his team was getting into his offense. I think, especially after they had such a great possession before that. 
And he well, I'm not sure what he's like. What he's so uh, upset about. He's got something he's got to beef with. Calling the referee over to discuss it with him, but it's a 30-second timeout. Power with a 14-point lead, 41-27, as you said, Tom. Really, this has been about the lack of St. Clair offense caused by turnovers just cutting down the number of possessions they've had. Yeah, it's one thing if your offense isn't working. It's another It's another one your offense isn't working, and you're kind of helping the other team's offense. It's a double-edged sword the Saints are playing with a little bit. Still only 14 points, and though we keep saying it. But it just feels like Tower could be up 25 at this point, at least a 20-point-ish lead. Um, the Saints defense, you could probably hear it on our broadcast. The, the, the bench is just begging them to play intense on defense. Um, they've gotten some stops. All you can ask is to make them shoot a tough shot, get the rebound, then worry about your offense. And again, I don't think Tower is an uh, offensive juggernaut. No. Uh, except off a fast break. You can see even now, look at three guys are swarming. Just that's protect the ball. Perfect. Good strength by Carter Dombrowski that time. And if they can just look up, there's going to be people open because, as you said, it's a swarming defense. Weather the storm in Sanders. many ways. To where? Better help defense there. Rebounded by Donaldson. Don't pick up your dribble here. And John Donaldson gets it over half court, court, guarded by Beasley. You can see how hard they're making them work to get into their offense. Gleason, good pass from Donaldson that time, but Grady Gleason draws a foul. That was a better job by Donaldson, I, I believe, of getting them into their offense. Don't dribble it down in the corner, right. even if you don't pick it up. Sometimes when you just stop, you're allowing the defense to get set. You're allowing that guy to get more up and in your face. He took a couple more dribbles, looked to the basket. That's another important thing, and he found somebody. Gleason, for a shot, off the window, good. A couple substitutions for Tower. We've got Anderson, and number four, that's Brownlee, replacing Beasley and Bills. Whoops, not Beasley. I was getting ready to uh, wonder why <laughs> Beasley was heading out of the basketball game, but. Second shot to Gleason, it's good. All right, back down to 11 point game. Saints showing a little bit of pressure. Zimmer up front. Oh, looked like a walk. Travel there, but not called. Anderson. Where, open. Can't get it, rebound, tipped away and controlled by Force him into another tough shot. That was a tough shot. Right. Now you gotta get the rebounds. Nice Much better defense. by Gleason. And as you said, let's get this down to single digits here by the end of the third quarter and see what kind of pressure you can put on Tower in the fourth. Tower has not made it to, to the basket easily at all so far in the second half, especially when you compare it to the first half. It's, it's making a huge difference. The Saints just got to find a way to get some buckets to cut into this lead. Sanders. Jared Lenarski in for Donaldson. Ware could pass. Brownlee's got it. Same play, kind of that slip screen. Too much concentration on Beasley and Brownlee. Yeah, and sometimes that help defense bites you. They, they found the man who was open because of that help. Dombrowski looked inside, not there. And again, Carter Dombrowski may not be quick, but he's strong. And you're not going to reach in and take the ball away from either him or Garrison very easily. No, not at all. they got strong bodies and, and uh, you know, a quick reach is not going to take the ball away from him. Posey comes in, replaces Sanders. And that's important. The Saints don't exactly have a bunch of guys who are handling the basketball uh, like Wizards or anything. So stay strong with the ball. Got to do it. Gleason to Zimmer. Scores again. Again, down to 11 points. Get him going in the double digits for Ryan Zimmer. He's up to 11 points by my unofficial tally. Drownley to Beasley. Saints fell asleep a little bit. 17 points now for Beasley. And here comes some pressure. So this is where you got to respond. Don't turn the basketball over. Get a good look. Get something you want. Get nice back. pass. 
Let's hear it from Dombrowski. Posey. Anderson. Roundly out front, over to Beasley. And we got a foul away from the ball that time on Dombrowski. Referee smartly separate the players. Just a minute 22 left here in the third. You like the intensity, but guess what? The referees all now have their whistles in their mouth. Oh yeah, they're ready. <laughs> Anderson. Good pass, good cut. Beasley knows what to do. He's, he is a clever, good player. That was a great cut without the ball. And a good pass by Anderson. And finished by, Saints just kind of going from one. Long three-pointer, short, and rebounded by Brownlee. Got to get back. Because where Anderson, nice pass, Brownlee off his hand, but he grabs it and scores, and all of a sudden back up to 15. The balance in the scoring from Tower is extremely impressive, but I, I got to tell you, these guys seem to know how to pass the basketball. They seem to understand their offense. And when somebody's come over to help, that's been multiple times that a different player has, has dumped that basketball off, gotten somebody an easier basket. They feel the help defense coming, dump the ball off. Griffin DeLore, Austin Schweiger come back in. Under a minute to play here, 49-34, third quarter. Coach Nicky Volok smartly gets Anderson and Beasley another couple seconds of rest in between here and the fourth. Brownlee knocks down the free throw. Biggest lead for Tower, 50-34, 16-point deficit now for St. Clair. Under a minute. Schweiger, Delore, Selleck. Tough place to pick it up. Good pass. And Zimmer with the foul. Drew the foul on Brownlee. Time foul on the floor. And Zimmer does a nice job of holding the ball high when he gets it. It's, the problem is getting it. And, and that's really more on the guards than Ryan. And, but he does a nice job. He holds the ball high. He can go either right or left. And he drew the foul. And you like to see it too because Brownlee is one of the of Towers, uh, taller players. Don't allow them to all of a sudden have a matchup that they like. Zimmer knocks it down. Second shot's up, and that was good as well. 14-point lead now. Hassan Posey brings it up against Schweiger. 30 seconds to go, just buckle down and play a good possession of defense. Where to Posey? Brownlee. Tipped away. Throw by Schweiger, and he's got it. Down deep, Brownlee. Long three-pointer, no good. Rebounded by Delore. And the Saints with a little bit of a burst there. But basically, that's status quo. After three, Saints trail 50-38. We'll be back in just a moment after a word from our sponsors. Neiman's Family Market. Experience the Neiman's Family difference. Fresh fruits and vegetables, where Michigan-grown products are featured daily. Local is more than what Neiman sells. It's who they are. From Grandpa John's Quality Meats since 1952, featuring a complete meat and deli department, to Grandma Sophie's Bakery, to the Corner Cafe, even a complete pharmacy to serve you. That's what Neiman's Family Market is. Experience the Neiman family difference. Welcome back, everyone. John Carter along with Tom Brenner. Saints versus Warren Woods Tower. Gold Division matchup here in the MAC. Basically, status quo, Tom. Uh, 
Started out with an 11-point deficit, finished up with a 12-point deficit. Saints just have not been able to put enough pressure on Tower to get it close. Yeah, you mentioned earlier that the Saints looked a little out of sorts. In other words, maybe uncomfortable at times. And, and Tower, quite frankly, the other way. They, they've seemed pretty comfortable in what they're doing offensively and defensively. See if they can't change it here. I got one quarter to figure it out. Schweiger gets a pick from Simmer. Ryan Simmer over to Griffin Delore. Looks in deep for Gleason. Gleason, hard of the basket, turns right. And can't buy it. Here comes Anderson. Picked up by up. Schweiger. But and we picked up by Tower, and they score. And that's been the story. Yeah. Too many turnovers from St. Clair. Had a bit of an advantage there, but uh, couldn't convert. Schweiger. Oh, the basket couldn't couldn't quite get it up high enough. Here's Beasley. Uh, Never took a dribble. Yep, just uh, an extra. He took a little extra hop step there. Yep. To get his feet set. He kind of gathered himself once he caught the basketball. I guess that's what happens when you dunk the ball three or four times in one game. Probably looking for another showtime moment. Donaldson and Dombrowski back in for St. Clair. Donaldson, nice pass. Gleason, right there. Down to 12, 52 40. Posey. Oh, another good play. Block. Schweiger. Down deep. Now make Gleason. it count. Donaldson, three. Oh, in and out. Oh, that had been a big one. Couldn't buy it. Here comes Beasley, and he's fouled. Good looking play that time by St. Clair, and got the shot they wanted, but just couldn't quite convert it. That would have brought it down underneath 10. Yeah, you, you always would love to uh, get your crowd back into it. But like you said, they got a good look. That's gotta be the positive taken away from that. And then, and then on the other end, Beasley wasn't able to go up for an easy basket. Makes the first foul shot. Matt Eisenhart comes back in. He's going to replace Zimmer. Ryan Zimmer's done a nice job keeping the Saints in touch. Six minutes, 33. Second shot's no good. Rebounded, though, by Anderson, and he's got an easy one. That's tough when you give up that rebound off the foul shot. Dombrowski, Donaldson. Schweiger down deep. Gleason, turn around. Good shot. They kind of got something going there. Gleason's gotten a few good looks here even in the fourth quarter already. I'm sure the Saints will continue to try to, uh, to do that. And that's Beasley guarding them too. 55-42, 13-point lead for... Tower. Nice block by Eisenhardt. Couple guys came with some good help. Here comes Gleason. And Saints once again just. <laughs> the turnover chart's not going to be fun to uh, no. review after this game. Might not be any more room on it. But give give Tower credit. That's good hustle to get back. Take away the passing lane. Yeah, they haven't taken too many plays off tonight. That's for sure. But when it comes down to it, the Saints just haven't had enough shots today. They no. probably shot close to 50%. Ryan Zimmer, very high percentage. Brady Gleason, high percentage. But they just don't have enough of them because of the turnovers. Correct. And even when they do, it, it hasn't necessarily even been 100% part of their offense and something that they really, really wanted to get. Number 12, Hassan Posey, Jr. Knocked down the first free throw. Second one's up, and it's good as well. Scott Selleck come back in. He's going to replay Schweiger. More pressure from Tower. This is going to be, again, one of those times 
Got to move the basketball a little bit. Eisenhardt got bumped a little bit out front, and he had the right idea. He was going to go directly to the basket once he's passed that player. And probably not the worst foul in the world either. Third foul for Anderson, but it's 534 left in the game. Dombrowski, Gleason, three-pointer. Nice shot. Gleason knocks it down. Lead back down to 12. This is where the Saints got to find a way to, to break down this 11 and 12 point lead wall. They got to find a way to get in single digits and see what happens. Beasley guarded by Donaldson. Posey. Oh. Anderson. Down deep. Good shot. Nabrowski all the way in and scores. Strong take. But as we know, when you're down 12, you can't trade buckets. You need to stop here on the defense. Come here. Posey took a couple extra that time. Ryan Zimmer comes back in, replaces Eisenhart. See if they can get the ball in here. Tower's going to be able to set back up. 59-47, 4 minutes, 36 seconds left. Get it in. Selleck. Donaldson. Started by Posey. Saints reset. There's Selleck down deep. Gleason. Different player guarding him now. Dombrowski, three-pointer. Off the rim, no good. Rebounded, tipped away by Bills. Here's Beasley. And good shot. He's crafty. You mentioned it. He's, he's a good basketball player. You can tell he's played a lot of basketball. He uh, certainly knows what he's doing with and without it. I got him up to 22 points on the night. And a very high shooting percentage. And yeah. Except for maybe one play that, that dunk where he tried to got a little bit too ahead of himself. He's played almost flawless basketball tonight. Yeah, and you know what? Good for him for responding <laughs> to that. We've seen some people come into this uh, into this gym and do something like that, and they shut it down. You know, that gets in their head too. Oh, I missed it. Or you know what? Uh, a little bit of credit to uh, to his coach. Right. <laughs> a lot of them might have sat him down. <laughs> And then, uh, but he stuck with him. He knows his player, uh, and he's earned it. You know, the, the Saints haven't necessarily made him work really, really hard for it. Um, but he's uh, he's running uh, after playing defense. He is playing defense uh, at a high level. But uh, he's earned every bit of his 22 points. All right, Saints trail, 61-47. Just under four minutes to play. You're watching St. Clair Saints varsity basketball here on community television and CTV. John Carr along with Tom Brenner. Saints come back, they'll have Garrison Dombrowski, Brady Gleason, Sean Donaldson, Scott Selleck, and Ryan Zimmer. And Anderson and Ware, they're in double digits as well for Tower. So for having a 22 point score, they've balanced it out pretty well. Gleason will bring it in. Man to man pressure still by Tower. Donaldson, guarded by Posey. We'll have Sean bring it up. Now, Tower doesn't want to foul at this point. They, they're in good shape. Tipped away. Anderson quite hard to make a cross-court pass. And, and again, picking up your dribble that far out with a lot of pressure from Tower. That's been the issue all day, all game. But even here, look at this off of, a, off of an inbounds play. Tower's all over him. Just said, when, when the Saints take that step backward and go into backcourt, Tower automatically double teams. And you, you've got to recognize that's coming. And the Saints haven't seen to figure that out yet. And again, T Tower takes it away. And can't quite control it before the end line. Getting a little chippy.
Leeson into Dombrowski. Here's a matchup that was getting chippy before that ball came in. Call called on Bills. Seven foul on Power. So both teams now in the one on one. The Saints can't afford to get chippy. <laughs> you're down 14 points. You never want to say you're out of a basketball game. But this actually helped the Saints here. Let them score with the clock. Yeah. Stopped. Knocks it down. Dombrowski, Carter Dombrowski, or uh, Garrison Dombrowski, I'm sorry, on the line, shooting second of two. In and out, rebounded by Guerre. Here comes Anderson. Guarded by Zimmer, way out front. Cross court. Long three-pointer, perfect. Yeah, they lost him. They kind of lost track there of uh, Matthew Bills. Zimmer, turnaround jumper, no good. Rebounded by Anderson. Anderson guarded by Selleck. Goes again, three-pointer, no good. Rebounded by Gleason. Gleason to Donaldson, up um, to Donaldson. Sean with a little bit of an angle. Saints calling for a bump. Calling for the travel. A little surprising with the way the last few minutes have gone, but that, that wasn't called a foul. Posey. Saints looking to trap here in the backcourt. Your Gleason, keep your head up here. Good pass. Where? Three. Where from Anderson. And now it's 18 points. 66 48, just over two minutes. Donaldson. Out to Zimmer. Gleason. Nice pass. Selleck. Can't get it. Rebounded by Anderson. Up ahead. Bills with the back bucket. Well, let's give uh, some credit to Charles Anderson, number 11. He's done a nice job. He's made a number of good passes, and he controls the ball very nicely. And he's, uh, he's been physical, too. Clock called. Ron Gleason. Up to a 20-point lead. We kind of talked about it. Spelled around around a 20 point game for the most part. They also go to the line, shoot. One on one. I think Both the officials are maybe uh, giving this one a little, bre a little breath. Yep. <laughs> Both teams kind of close. Clearing the benches here, yeah. in the 41, 20 point lead, and uh, probably a smart move there by hand. Coach Tan. <laughs> Some of his guys have been playing, uh, using a lot of energy, a lot of emotion, probably a little tired. Now Saints will fall to two and two in the, uh, the gold. Power will be up at three and one. One and one here. First shot's up, and it's good. Up, it's coming schedule for St. Clair. They go to South Lake on Friday. Second shot's up and good also by Bills. And then we have a double header actually, both boys and girls on Tuesday. Boys play Sterling Heights. The girls go against Lakeshore. Girls are in center line right now. Schweiger. 
goes to the basket. That's going to be off the leg, I think, of St. Clair. Driver, Matt McTeevy is in. Number 41, Reed Packin. Garrison Dombrowski picked away by Schweiger. And number 10, Kevin Rogers in for the first time this evening. And what coaches like to see here is you, 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 you play the right way. Yes. Run your sets, play good defense. You're not going to make up a 22-point deficit in a minute and a half. And kids at the bench here, they need to play good defense, play good basketball. And hustle. Brownlee, long three-pointer. No good, rebounded. Number 30 is Nativia. Matt Nativia brings it up. Over to Carter Dombrowski. Carter by Brownlee. Gets to the basket, draws a foul. Two shot foul. Not really sure who it's on. Take the foul, number 25. 25, Anthony Rissman commits the foul. His first. I think they drew his name out of a hat. <laughs> he was close. Pick one of two or three guys who were in the vicinity. Dombrowski shot, and it's good. Well, the good news is, is if you're a coach, it's, it seems fairly simple of uh, what went wrong, so to speak, in this game. Um, and they're things that are correctable, you know, and, and sometimes with a little experience, too. Second shot by Carter Dabrowski is good. Back down to a 20-point game. Tower bring it in. Knocked away, controlled by number 10, Kevin Rogers, with the reverse for two. And they'll save Tower's basketball. Some of these young guys getting in here. Doing a good job hustling, playing some pressure defense. Risman. Number five is Kyles. 23, Darian Mills for Tower. Guarded by Reed Packin. Almost knocked away. Down deep, Brownlee. He's got it. Good pass by Tower down to Donovan Brownlee. Schweiger. Blocked by Brownlee. And that, I think, will be about it. Yep. Tower with a convincing 72-52 victory on St. Clair's home court. And that's going to put them in first place with a three and one record. Saints dropped to two and two. And, and Tom, as you said, fairly simple. The Saints just turned the ball over too often tonight. Yeah, and sports are normally pretty reactive, right? So I imagine that the Saints uh, at some point will practice how to break uh, break the press a little bit, probably a little ball handling, moving the basketball. And, and of course, uh, offensively, um, there are some things to learn, I'm sure, when they look back on this game. Um, but all correctable, you know, all things that I think when he looks back on it, uh, he can say, look it, here's this turnover and look what happened on the other end. Here's a turnover and look what happened. It's, uh, it's sometimes difficult to teach when you say, hey, you turned it over and they don't score. Now, <laughs> it's pretty obvious. Pretty we turned clear. it over, we had to chase them, they scored. We turned it over, had to chase them, they scored, and we are exhausted. <laughs> and we're down 11. We're down 12. We had to hear Mr. Carter talk about how we're down 10, 11, 12 most of the game, and they turned it over again and they scored. Uh, so th th they'll get it fixed. And you know what? This is as we talked about before. New coach, got some new players. You're playing in the league now. These games get ramped up a notch when it comes to the intensity. But it's good to get these guys the experience of it and learn something. Well, Saints dropped this one, 72-52. Well, that's going to be it for us here tonight. Tom Brenner, JP on camera, John Carter. We'll see you next week as the Saints have a doubleheader on Tuesday. Good night, everybody. This CTV Sports presentation has been brought to you by St. Clair Chevy, Buick GMC. We care.
by Murphy Inn Restaurant and Hotel in St. Clair. By North Star Bank, North Star guiding the way. By Neiman's Family Market. By St. Clair Home Goods and Ace Hardware. And by CTV Community TV in Marine City and St. Clair.